Yo guys, welcome back to the channel. And um, so I was gonna make this video tomorrow. However, I got super excited that I found um, Android 10. Now this is Android 10 beta built by Pixel Experience. So I downloaded the file from them. I'll try to include the, the link in the description. If you've already um, unlocked the bootloader on your Nexus 5X and you've already installed custom ROMs, then you'll be able to do this one. Now let me tell you guys about some of the frustrations that I had with it first before going forward. Um, do not dirty flash this ROM. I did that, making that mistake, and it caused for Google Frameworks to just totally collapse on me. I mean, as soon as the ROM booted up, I got hit with Google Frames not working, for stop it, and then messages, Play Store, everything just started, like, for stopping. Literally had to, like, completely wipe everything, internal storage and all. I ended up flashing this ROM on here like six times before it finally booted up. And even then the boot up process was like very sluggish and it, I just fought hard to get through and get into the actual operating system itself, which now you guys can see is prevalent and available. So I'm just letting you guys know, if you're gonna flash this ROM to do it, um, do a, a clean install. Wipe everything. If you have like like a, a, a USB drive that you can use an OTG to connect to it, I would suggest storing the ROM on that and just wiping everything, including internal storage, and then flashing the ROM itself. Do not flash Majisk on here. I tried doing that, and it completely corrupted it, and it just got into a boot loop that was just like crazy insane. So yeah, um, I don't have Magisk on here. I don't have Root or anything like that. However, games like Pokemon Go will know that this is a custom operating system, so they won't let me play it on here. But let me show you guys that this is Android 10. So we'll go in here, go down to About Device. And you guys can see right there, Model Hardware is the Nexus 5X. Um, and why is it going out of focus? Sorry, shaky camera. Um, Android 10. And then Android 10 with September 5th security patch. So if I go up here, tap, boom, Android 10. Android 10 it is on here. Now, it has all the goodies that you would want from Android 10. So like um, basically, yeah, dark theme. Um, you can go into... Uh, developer options to pretty much like change the accents and everything so you have all access to that right there um, now it doesn't have like the same uh, customizations or some of the customizations from the pixel experience previous to this now that's only just because of the fact that um, this is based on stock Android with no like after um, customizations even though they could add it in there they did not um, everything seems to be working just fine uh, as far as like you know taking pictures and videos and stuff like that um, we'll go to the camera here and there I am on camera take a quick little video and I will try to put this picture in picture video or maybe I'll just put it at the end of the video um, but there I am as you guys can see the, the camera does get a little buggy at times as you guys can see right there got a little buggy just saving the um, video file and you guys can see I took one while riding in the car which is actually pretty cool. I'll post these videos, or maybe I'll just post them on my Instagram for you guys. You guys can go to my Instagram, Aloha and Aloha underscore Android. Um, but yeah, and um, so we'll go there. Now you gotta be careful when you're gonna switch between cameras because you can actually just back out. So we'll just take that, and you guys see right there, camera error. So um, that's like the first time that I've seen that today. There, I took a picture just fine. We'll flip it around and do a selfie and it took that one just fine but then again um, yeah so the cameras a little bit buggy but not bad and it is working and you guys can see that it has all these um, videos pictures and stuff like that that I took with the ROM itself so uh, cameras is working on here Wi-Fi is working and if I take it off Wi-Fi um, it should possibly connect to nope it was doing this earlier, I seen this, but it could be just my phone itself. Um, as it was doing this before, even without this custom ROM on here, when I had it on Android 9 Pie, it was doing this where it wasn't reading the SIM card. So now it says mobile network, Google Fi. Um, let's see here, and then it goes away. So that's just crazy. Anyhow. 
no, it's not showing it there. So, anyways, um, I'll still probably continue with it. Maybe there might be some bugs or whatever. I'll look more into that. Um, but I know that it was doing this pre uh, previously before with the SIM card. Something's up with it because uh, it did that when I put the actual Google Fi SIM card in there. This one that's in here right now is just a data only SIM card, and I didn't think it was going to do this, but it's actually doing it. So, but earlier it actually activated and told me that it can only give me access to Google Fi app rather than um, making phone calls or anything like that. So I'll look into it, but I'm pretty sure it's just my device itself and not so much the fact that the custom ROM. But then again, this is beta. So when the uh, Pixel Experience team puts out another one, I'll definitely give you guys an update on that. But yeah, um, other than that, pretty much everything works flawless. I mean, for what to be expected, this is like, what, a four-year-old device? It came out in 2015. So um, I didn't expect it to be like super buttery smooth but it is handling it is handling things pretty much decently as you guys can see there there's some jank a little stutter there and but that's to be expected from the type of processing chip that this has and no mine's has not suffered the um the boot loop issue thank thankfully it never has just yet and on yes i'm afraid it might in the future but i'm just gonna rock this phone as much as i can Right it until the wheels falls off. So anyways, guys, that's pretty much it. Just my rundown on Android 10 on the Nexus 5X. And I'll put the link in the description to the Pixel Experience site so you guys can download it for yourself. Um, if you have not unlocked the bootloader on your Nexus 5X um, and you want to try this ROM out, go ahead. Um, go to XDA. That's the best source to get uh, not only Torp Recovery to install using ADB, but, um, yeah, good source to get um, your custom ROMs and things like that regarding the Nexus 5X. So uh, drop a like if you guys enjoyed this video. If you just found this video and decided to subscribe to my channel, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much for doing so. Uh, hit the bell option to be notified when I upload another video. And for those people who say I should include which phone I'm recording this video on, this is the Pixel 3 that I'm recording this video with. So there, I tagged it. Anyways, guys, again, thanks for watching so much. And as always, aloha.